Well, hello, y'all. Huh. I was just over sitting in the parking lot uh, at Terry's, and I had backed into this parking space next to Lou's car. And I backed in because if I saw anybody coming, I wanted to be able to start and leave and apologize to them. Anyway, I'm sitting there because uh, I was going to get some groceries from Lou to help with Terry's birthday dinner tomorrow, or birthday lunch. Um, and uh, an ambulance and a fire truck pulled up. I was praying that it wasn't Terry, but you know how that is. You just, uh, I won't say I knew, but I wasn't surprised. Cindy called me and told me. He was in his bedroom, and he'd been in there for a while, and then I guess Lou said she heard a bump. And so she went in there, and he was on the floor, and he had uh, some blood, not a lot, but you know your head bleeds a lot. Um, so, um, the param when the paramedics got there, they said, we're going to take him. Uh, to Tri-City for overnight, you know, observation. They said it doesn't look that bad. He may not even need to have stitches. But here we go, y'all. He's in the hospital. I can't call him. I can't go see him. And if they put him back in that nasty rehab place, all hell is going to break loose. He was so traumatized. He is still traumatized from being there. I just wanted to let you know, and please, please, please pray for him, okay, please, that it's not serious, but for sure that he does not have to go back to that place, and I am going to talk to Cindy about it. There's no reason why he should have to, because I could take care of him. If Lou can't do it, I can. So anyway, y'all, it's not appropriate to say have fun, but please pray for Terry, okay? Thank y'all 